Uh, the Atlantic closed out the Chance Clear Classic with a 7-1 win. Coach, that was a dominant performance after four one-run games. How did you guys get it done? Well, we got great pitching again today, and it was great to see because it was a little bit of a staff day. You know, we, we had a number of pitchers that have been out on the mound for the second and third time today, uh, but they've all been so efficient that they weren't up pitch total-wise and we were able to get off to a good start. Uh, I was really pleased with Cody Sedlock. He was dominant for the first four innings. And Nick Blackburn gave us a great, uh, you know, a great uh, basically, you know, uh, two-inning roller skin. And then you look at what J.D. Nielsen did in a pressure situation. He came in, got some big outs, and Tyler Day came in the roll. Along with that, they played very, very, very well defensively. Uh, and that goes back to the pitching. If you have very good pitching, you're going to play well defensively because you're in a rhythm and balls aren't uh, just hammered at you. Uh, and then if you look at what we did offensively, it was good to see us break out of things today. Uh, really, really pleased with uh, you know, a lot of people in the lineup. I thought we had good bats. Uh, we rolled out 11 or 12 hits and uh, really got a lot of production out of our DH slot. Like, uh, Pat McNary came up with a big ball offense uh, for two RBIs and to really you know, stretch the game out a little bit. And then as things were you know, just a little bit tighter, Matthew James came in with a pitch hit home run and uh, you know, gave us back that four run lead. So just a very, very well played game. How would you create the whole overall week? You went three and two, two one-run losses, but the offense was stepping up late to uh, finish the week and out. Yeah, I was really disappointed with our two losses just because I didn't think we did what we needed to do offensively. Uh, one game, we just let things get away from the defensive standpoint. And so, you know, there are a couple disappointments in there, uh, but we learned from them, and we got better each and every day. And after really struggling for four games offensively, we came out today and uh, had a very, very good offense today. So, you know, it shows the guys aren't pouting. Uh, you know, they just keep playing the game hard, and we're playing together as a 